The overall goal of this procedure is to titrate glycogen in vitro in cell samples. This is accomplished by first lysing the cells by mechanical disruption. The second step is to hydrolyze the glycogen with alpha amylase to obtain the glucose. Next, the glucose is oxidized, producing a fluorescent species. The final step is to measure the fluorescence. Ultimately, biochemical titration of glycogen is used to show changes in glycogen content in cells. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods is that it is quantitative, sensitive, accurate and very specific. To begin this procedure, seed cells at a concentration of 0.5 to 2 million per 100 millimeter diameter dish. Incubate the cells for 24, 48, or 72 hours in hypoxia in an anaerobic workstation set at 1% oxygen, 94% nitrogen, and 5% carbon dioxide. In parallel, incubate another set of cells in normoxia. For each oxygen condition, change the 25 millimolar glucose-containing medium every 24 hours to minimize variations in the glucose concentration during the experiment. After treatment, wash the cells twice with PBS to remove traces of glucose from the culture medium. Then scrape the cells in cold PBS. Centrifuge the PBS solution at 1000 RPM for 5 minutes. Discard the supernatant and wash the pellet once with PBS.